Jamaican dumplings. He's going to show us how to make some Jamaican, Jamaican Goldberg. Jamaican Goldberg? Yeah, we call it dumpling Jamaican Goldberg. Goldberg. Jamaican Goldberg. So, if you guys want to see how to make some Jamaican dumplings, this is... You eat dumpling? Yeah, I, I do. I like chicken and dumplings. Uh, my you mother... dumpling like yeah. 10 dumplings? I've eaten some dumpling here the other day that Rose makes. Now, I want to show you something why he's throwing away the trash or digging away for more food. Or... I'll take this back. I guess the boss does treat, treat the people nicely. They do have diesel generator. So they do have electricity at night time. So if that makes the... Uh, the people who want to say, oh, protest against Jamaican, give them better living quarters like they do in China and Indonesia, like they did in Nike. If you guys want to boycott Jamaican coffee because of the way they live, uh, well, up to you. I'm not saying nothing. I'm not saying nothing. Not saying the goddamn word, but let's see what he's going to do. Put a little bit of salt. Let's see what he's up to. So what's the yellow stuff? You got white and yellow. Cornmeal. Cornmeal? Oh, that's cornmeal and with yeah. flour. Man, I, I missed out, man. So it's half and half cornmeal and with yeah. with flour, half and half. All right. Easy to remember, everybody. Well, this is going to be good, man. I'm hungry, too. I got enough weed that we'll get you with stone one more time, and that's about it. Everybody took all the marijuana, the, all the growers out there. But I left enough where we'll get stoned for for part of the day. Oh, sorry guys, I wasn't uh, filming. I was filming down there. Yeah, I put a, a little bit of marijuana out there and it disappeared. Chopped it all up. Asked everybody if they wanted to roll a joint. Everybody who got up and ran over there. And it was gone before the last guy got to it. <laughs> so I, here you go. Here's a joint I'll pre roll. Be happy. <laughs> Be happy. Because I got to smoke the rest of the day too. Jamaican, they are loving people, man. Now, I hope you washed your hands before you're doing this. No, I'm fucking with you, all right? Wash your hands. It was a joke. I don't care. Down in Mexico, you get a hamburger. Hey, they don't wash their hands. All you get is just whatever they've touched before. <laughs> I would film you, but you don't want to be filmed, so I'm not going to film you. Huh? You don't want to be on YouTube, so I'm not going to film you. So how come you don't have the... Someone will film you, but you don't want... No, no. How come you don't have the Jamaican women cooking for you and just pay them money and tell them, you know, you cook for us and we'll feed you free and we'll give you a little money for a beer too. That's what you need to do. That's what I would be doing. But you guys like cooking for yourself, huh? Do you like cooking? Yeah. Damn. We are not at home. Oh, you're yeah. not. Away yeah, from home. Yeah. So, you have to do everything for yourself. When you are at home, then you have someone to help you. Yeah, they you. cook you. Yeah. I'll cook for you. But here is but, the home. But you're... You can... Wonderland. <laughs> She's... Sweetie.
A coffee bean farmer. Be our next cook for the day. That's fun. Yeah, you'll be on YouTube, okay? Okay. <laughs> How you doing, my friend? Mm -hmm. Not too bad. We've we seen your face before around here. So how are you doing? How's life treating you with that ganja? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I've given this gentleman a lot of ganja in the last few days. Keeping you happy and smiling on your face. Yeah. Make you feel good. Make you feel, well, you should smoke a joint with this. <laughs> can I manage it? You can't handle it? Do you, can you handle rum? Uh -huh. Can you handle rum? Yeah. Do you? You like rum? Well, you can go have some rum with this on my birthday. And when is your birthday? This Saturday, Sunday, Sunday actually, but we're going to be drinking the rum Saturday and Saturday night. But I yeah, want to go home on Saturday, but I will be here on Sunday. You'll be here on Sunday? Yeah. It'll be too late. Okay. Sorry. Well, we might begin drunk Sunday too. We'll see, okay? Yeah, yeah. I'll see what happens on Sunday. I, kn I know that I want to go have... Have a good meal on Sunday somewhere. Now we're going to go up uh, to uh, Mount Blue Mountain Peak on a Saturday night. But we were warned by a range park ranger that that we can't spend a night up on Blue Mountain Park. Okay. On Blue Mountain Peak, we can go to. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is what they do. They say they chop it up just like a little. So what's in here? Just water? Yeah. Salt? This is not Jamaican cooking. Jamaican dumpling. Meal dumpling. All right, we'll see how good it is. I know Rose makes a really good dumpling, just like this. Rose, Rose, give you a dumpling. Yeah, Rose down there at uh, Wildflower Lodge. Yeah. Yeah, she's a she's sweet. She's my cousin. Is she your cousin, Rose? Uh, yeah. So you was born and raised up here? Huh? You was born and raised up here? No. 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 Yeah, Rose is a sweet little lady. Runs around with her glasses on. <laughs> so what else are you going to put in here? In the pot? Yeah. Nothing else. Nothing else? No vegetables? This is what the fuck we're going to be eating for breakfast this morning? What the hell are you trying to do? Kill my fucking white ass? <laughs> really? No eggs? No bacon? This is breakfast? This is <laughs> you will see what I'm going to do. Uh, well, we're all going to see what you're going to be doing. <laughs> People around the world are going to be seeing what the hell you're going to be feeding me today. <laughs> And I paid how much for this meal? <laughs> That's your friend, your brethren. Yeah, he's my friend. I have respect for him. Yeah. He's got a lot of marijuana cigarettes from me. Okay. Matter of fact, I don't think he's bought weed since he's, I've been on top of this mountain. <laughs> Do you like this food? Yeah. 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 Not the best? Uh huh? Is it the best food you do yeah. you like it? Yeah. Everybody likes this food. Yeah. To me, uh, Rose's 
Rosa's bit, uh, dumplings are kind of really hard. Okay. Yeah. You know, it's eatable. I, I can eat it, but it's real hard and chewy. This is the same way as they're going to be soft with this oatmeal or cornmeal. Yeah. I think the cornmeal is going to be a lot softer than, I think that's all she was, Rose was using, just pure flour. Okay. So I'm going to give it that one hot. So how how much in Jamaican dollars did you use to uh, to make all this? How much? Roughly, like say five hundred dollars, three hundred. But a five hundred dollar can give you a little meal. Yeah. With a little that meat. Big meal in about you alone. Yeah. Yeah. That can give you chicken, goat, whatever you want. Rice, flour, bread, bulla, whatever you want. So this all costed right here three hundred Jamaican dollars, or third thirty. No, the flour, flour, flour and the cornmeal. Five hundred dollars, five hundred Jamaican. Dollars. See? Yeah. Five hundred Jamaican dollars can give you to make all this. Yeah. You're going to be feeding a lot of people off of this, though. Eh? Darling, darling, give me them. So, 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 up here, do you, one person cooks for everybody, and the next day somebody else cooks for everybody? No, no, everyone no. cook for themselves. And this is all for you? Tell them what you eat, huh? For us. Is this for us? Yeah. I'm not going to be eating all that. You're going to eat all this? Yeah, you eat what you want. And then save it for later. Yeah. Okay, Whatever you can save you this. you can eat, you eat. I, I'm going to probably be able to eat one, maybe two at the most. Now, if it was with some meat, like with some goat or some yeah. pork or some chicken, then I probably could eat three of them. Okay, you eat pork? You love it? Uh, you know, it depends how it's cooked. How it cook. Oh, you like it when it cooked? Uh, I like it deep barbecue pit. That's the best way to eat any type of meat. What they do is they uh, dig a hole or it's laid in with brick and they build a big old huge fire and then they okay. let the fire burn down the coal yeah. and then they put the meat inside I mean, of some cloth. They jerk it. Is it? We call it jerk in Jamaica. Well then they uh, slow cook it like eight hours. Well they cover it up with dirt, okay? Okay. Uh, and then they, well, they put tin on it and they cover it up with dirt. And then they let it slow cook for like eight, nine hours, and then they pull it out, and it's just the it, meat falls right off the bone. Okay. And that's the best cooking in, in the, that I've ever tasted. Okay. Now I want to try your jerk, uh, jerk chicken, chicken and, your jerk and jerk pork. pork. Yeah, and he says he knows how to make some good jerk yeah. meat. So uh, are you a pro at making jerk huh? meat? Do you, you make good jerk chicken? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Do you have the all the firewood up here to make it? No. No? You need a special firewood? She, she had to go home. Yes. Yeah, Where is not her home? Where's your home? Santa Mass. Santa Mass? Yeah. So, what type of wood do you guys use to jerk your... Dry wood. Any type of dry wood I found, I just use them. Really? You know, in Mexico, they use mesquite. It's mesquite. Yeah, yeah but we call it mesquite or mesquite. And, uh, and it's a hardwood tree, and it really it leaves a really nice flavor in the meat. And that's what a lot of Mexicans in the United States cook with. Then they use oak, I think, and uh, maple. They use a lot of maple. The maple smoked... Uh, you know, bacon, stuff like that. But I prefer mesquite. But you guys don't have no mesquite up here. No. What the hell are you talking to, man? You talking to that telephone right there? Yeah. 
It's my baby. It's, uh, <laughs> it's your baby. You're my new phone. I'm a baby. You know? <laughs> it's your baby. You can't live without it. Where's your phone? I don't have a phone. I lost. I I bought a really expensive one with a really nice camera, and I lost one day. And since you're in Jamaica, yeah, I just don't have no telephone. I'm, you know, if I'd plan on living here in Jamaica, yeah, I'd probably get a phone. But I I never did. I haven't had one in Mexico. It just seemed like everybody was calling you up. What the hell are you doing, man? Come over here. Come over there. And it just yeah, when I lost the phone, I just got like that peace and quiet when I want to go do something to call up my friends hey let's go and don't have nobody hey I'm going to be here today okay yeah I got had too many friends and so when I lost my phone I lost a lot of friends so yes, I just yes. keep a low profile and it's it's more money in my pocket because when you're with your friends yeah. you drink a lot you, you buy food for everybody okay It's a nice day today. Yeah. Well, yesterday was hot. Yeah, today is cool. Yeah. That sun was all out all day long yesterday. Where, I stayed. Where you was yesterday? I had underneath shade all day. Okay. Oh hell no! I didn't You're go out. Relaxing. In the sun. Oh, I burnt my face this those whole week. I, my face looks like a goddamn red cherry pepper. Okay. Burns too, yeah. like one. The sun let it red. Yeah. Okay. So when I un, see, I lived under clouds most of my life, okay. and when it, when it's not cloudy, I move from that land and go somewhere where it's cloudy. At I've always enjoyed the clouds, and where I live at Mexico, it's usually if it's sunny, you know, I I stay indoors. If it's like cloudy like this and it's blue sky like it, this looks like Mexico a lot of days like this, okay. just like this. And so I, I like days like that, nice and cool. Okay. Well, that's the end of the video, okay? I don't see too much more. We'll just chit chat and smoke some more weed, and I'll let you know what the final product is before we eat it, okay? Let's see what he comes up with on the side. I'll tell you guys a story before I before I, I shut off this video. I was in Mexico and picked up this guy on the side of the road and he turned around and he asked me where I was going. I says, Why well, I, I got a flat tire, I need to fix my tire up. He says, Okay, go in this town. So I, I fixed my flat tire and he goes, Where are you going at now? And I said, Hello, I don't know. I'm just driving around. He goes, Well, I got a nice place where you can stay at. And he takes me on this land, and it's a big old huge lake. Yeah. And it's underneath ponderosa pine trees. It's more beautiful than these pine trees. Bigger, uh, like 380 years old. And all around this mountain, all it was just ponderosa pine trees everywhere. Just as far as you can see. And he had this big lake, and he goes, You can park your trailer right here underneath this ponderosa pine tree and stay as long as you want, gringo. And <clears throat> he goes, uh... Come over to the house tonight for dinner time. And said, sure, I'll come over to this house. So uh, I went to this house that night, and his wife invited me in. And all we had was eggs, beans, and tortillas for dinner. Yeah. And all my life, I've always eaten meat. Mm -hmm. And every time, every meal, all my life, I've always eaten meat. Meat. Any type of meat. But always had meat on my plate all my life. Yeah. So I... Uh, I turned around, said thanks, and woke up the next morning. Well, they invited me to breakfast. And guess what they had for breakfast? Beans, eggs, and tortillas. Oh. And I said, is this all you guys eat yeah. every day? And they said, yeah, we yeah, ain't like this all of our lives. And I said, man, this, no, this is not the way to live. No. So I bought them some nice pot and pans. I uh, bought them cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, yeah. Uh, yeah. bread, a whole bunch of meats. And well, I, I lived on their land for uh, a little over a month and a half. And I 
And I just told the lady, I says, you cook my meal and I'll feed the family. I said, and wash my clothes. I said, if you wash my clothes and cook for me, I'll feed the family like okay, this okay. until I leave. Yeah. So, you know, we picked out every day pancakes for breakfast. They didn't know how to make pancakes. So this is how you make pancakes. <laughs> just <laughs> taught them the good life. But it was a great time. But when I left, I know they... Which country is that? It's in Chihuahua, Mexico, up in the mountains, Sierra Madres. Yeah. It was, a, it was a pleasure living with them for a month, got to learn their culture and everything. And okay. Yeah, they didn't have running water to their house, no electricity. They had a fireplace that warmed up their house, and so they cooked inside the house on top of the fireplace. Okay. And so they would heat the house, and on top they had, uh, you know, cast iron where they can cook them. But can you imagine eating beans, eggs, and tortillas every, every day. day? Every no. day? Uh, no thanks. Not me. I have to eat meat. Yeah, meat. That's me. Yeah, I, I do love have meat. Any type, yeah. man. Any type. Yeah. Seafood. Any type. Yeah, I love meat. Yeah. I love my meat. I think we all do. Yeah. <laughs> Especially, I. You know what? I like jerky. I can eat jerky all day long. Yes. So I want to try this jerk. Yeah. You're gonna jerk love chicken. It. Yeah. You're gonna love it. Yeah. Now you guys do not have turkeys in Ma in Jamaica on huh? no, turkeys chicken. You oh, have turkey, but well, you have to go to the like the hotel. Yeah. yeah. Oh, they they they, they, they oh really in the hotels? Yeah, in the but hotel. I bet you they want a turkey meal. Uh, yeah. A lot of money, lot of huh? Money. And because you, in, in, in. Uh, getting hard to see. In the, in the hotel. Tail. You have like turkey, you have rabbits, you have all different type of meat. In the Bowls, hotel? Bowls, yeah. But I bet you a plate of food costs $300, yeah, $200. Yeah, it's the only thing that they take it in package. Like you pay for the food, right. the room, whatever. Right. Yeah, he does take everything. Yeah, on the one package, he just charge you. So whatever you want, just come to you. So, Interesting, yeah. but how much would a like a a turkey meal cost? Do you know, no, you know, no. you never eaten turkey in there. No. <laughs> and I never eat turkey. You never eat never. turkey. You never eaten it. No. Man, we gotta find a place over there and have a turkey dinner one night. Yeah. You'll like it. But you know, in Mexico, they, they don't have the turkeys in Mexico like they do in the United States. United States, a turkey would run, you know, like 38 pounds, 28 pounds for turkey, big old huge things. And in Mexico, they use the, they, they only own the wild turkeys that you see in the United States in the wild. That's their turkeys. So, uh, most definitely, uh, I don't like the turkeys in Mexico. I don't like turkey. And I've eaten it before and it just didn't taste too good. Yeah. Real dark, tough meat. Turkey. There's the sun out today right now. Fuck, I need to find some shade. If I go back here, here. Jamaican cooking. All right, I'm going to... So what are you going to put on this jam? Are you going to put sugar? Are you going to put cheese? Are you going to put... I'm going to cook some veggie chunks with these dumplings. Veggie chunks? Yeah. All right, well... I'll show you what the next video is going to be like, okay, when he's done, all right? But I'm going to save my hard drive. Bye. Yeah, thumbs up or thumbs down. Do you think they need a new kitchen, a new cooking area?
Dang, that looks good. Who cooked that? You did? No, your friend. My friend. Really? You know what is it? What is it? Chicken? Mackerel. It's in mackerel and rice. Mackerel and rice? Yeah. Looks very good. Yeah, this is tin mackerel and rice. Well, you know, in Mexico, they say provecho in, okay. in Spanish. That means enjoy your meal. Provecho. Okay. That looks better than what I'm about to eat. <laughs> Be honest with you. Why can't you cook like this? You have oh, to you, have, rice, you have to have money. Rice. No, you mm -hmm. don't have to have money. You can use the, the flour money and buy rice if you want. Oh, okay. Yeah, but I eat rice last night. I eat rice yesterday. I don't want any rice today. You, you don't want rice no, today? No, I want some dumpling today. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. Their sleeping quarters got like about 10 beds in there or something like that. Wind's blown, guys. I'll see you later.